This week on Tips and Tricks, we're looking at a very strong talent, Insults and Injury. It's easy to use and super versatile, so let's check it out. The tooltip for Insults and Injury states, All effects from Word of Spite last for one additional second. This is one of your level 5 talents exclusive to my girl Zenobia. To begin, let's see what Word of Spite's all about. So the ability breaks armor for 3 seconds and deals 85 damage. Now, armor breaks deal 15 damage a second. Damage takes in Gigantic usually happen right when the debuff is applied, so that's why we see 100 damage at first and 15 twice after. Adding I and I gives us an extra second of armor break and another 15 damage. With this, every 6 seconds you can have 4 seconds of armor break, which is pretty crazy all around. Now we'll look at some upgrades. Demoralizing Cry becomes a 3 second speed boost on you and 3 seconds slowed on the enemy. This means 50% of the time, you can be moving faster and slowing your opponent. Screaming Halt adds another second to the duration, but 5 to the cooldown. So 4 seconds out of every 11. Now, adding 5 seconds to the cooldown sucks, but if you've been hit by it, you know those 4 seconds of cripple feel like an eternity. This is very strong. Feast of Spite buffs your speed boost by giving you 50 health each tick. So without I and I, you gain 100 health, and with it, you gain 150. Now that's pretty decent for a leech build, and it's buffed by another's keeper and conduit of despair for some sweet synergy. And finally, cutting words with I and I adds an extra 50 damage to the mix. Since the cooldown is so short, this damage can really add up, and Zenobi has no problem applying debuffs, so you can reliably proc the damage component. Revel in Anguish and Hero's Might also synergize for some awesome burst. So next time you're playing Zenobia, I hope you give I and I a try.